back, Timmy. Welcome back, Miss Clara. Timmy, open the gate, please. I want to see Mr. Sparrow. Outsiders detected. Do you wish to permit access? It's okay. They're all my guests. Command received. Access restriction terminal unlocked. Welcome back, Miss Clara and guests. If you can, please try not to upset Mr. Svarog. It's okay, Clara. We're here to reason with him. I'll leave negotiations to you guys. They're not my strong point. Negotiating with robots. I can't say I've tried it before. Are you ready? Mr. Sparrock. I see that the energy supply system is back online. Thank you, Clara. But why have you brought them? Mr. Sparrock, they want to talk to you about going to the surface. Analyzing. Analysis result. Target does not belong to wildfire. Background unknown. Classification unknown. You have arrived on Clara's recommendation. I will give you an opportunity to speak. Oh, uh, hey, sounds like he's willing to communicate. Quick, time to smooth talk him. You seek peace. Understood. Nevertheless, your statement is unilateral. My position will be determined after assessing the result of our negotiation. Proceed with your central point. Do not waste this world's valuable time. Uh, he cut you off completely. This guy. Stay focused. Remember, we have to make him see that we're a variable in the calculation. Stellaron. Searching database. Access denied. Discussing Stellaron with unauthorized targets. Prohibited. You are broaching a secret that lies at the heart of this world. A secret that should remain unknown to humanity. Reassessing targets. Threat index raised. I demand that you reveal your true intention. Mm, as expected. He knows of the Stellaron, but it's a restricted topic. We've come this far. Out with it already! Just be straight with him. Everything depends on it. Historical records state that humanity has already made multiple efforts to engage with the Stellaron. Without exception, these efforts have been motivated by human greed, attempts to secure the article for a selfish end. As instructed by the architects, any attempt to engage with the Stellaron will result in grave consequences. Reassessing. Target threat index critical. What should we do? This is going from bad to worse. There is no evidence to suggest you are an exception. Calculation result remains unchanged. Peacekeeping protocol temporarily disengaged. Requesting extermination protocol launch. E extermination? In the literal sense? Peace talks are over. March. Prepare for combat. Mr. Sparrow, please don't. Leave, Clara. Clara, it's dangerous here. Find somewhere to hide. <sighs> Looks like we have to take action after all. Prototype number three. Monitoring Automaton Sparag. Extermination protocol launch. Successful. Annihilation permitted. Great. Another walk in the park. Rules are made to be broken. <laughs> Luck of the draw. Please, 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 please. <laughs> Looks like victory! Oh, 
upgrade. Watch this! Let's go. <laughs> Better late than never. Time for the payout. Looks like somebody needs a doctor. <laughs> Gotta get those vitamins. <laughs> Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Operation. Let's make it quick. Batter up! <laughs> Time to show you! What's in your prescription? <gasps> Thanks a lot! Wait for the tiles before you start counting. Wow! Ugh, this hand sucks! Come on! Don't need this style. Stay right there while I give you a present. Let me tend to you. Time machine threshold. Try that again. Can you put up your best fight without a doctor on the battlefield? All of you, stay focused. I'm right behind you. Nat, uh, how did you... Guess you guys had a bad talk, huh? Luckily, Sampo's got your back. Sampo! <laughs> I knew you'd be involved somehow. Base breached. Armed wildfire personnel detected. Assessing. All subjects are high-risk individuals. Commencing complete annihilation. Purge initiated. You bully! Luck of the draw. Please, 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 please. Uh, looks like... Try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. <laughs> Rules are made to be broken. Calculating result. Oh, great. Another walk with me out here? How can we lose? Let's go. That's a set! Fights are like gambling. You have to choose when to strike. Looks like somebody needs a doctor! Stay off! Reinforcer. Analysis complete. You can't! Risk individual. Stay right there while I give you a present. Let's make it quick. To me. Uh. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. Uh. Wait for the tiles before you start counting. Wow. Better late than never. <laughs> Let's go. Take this. <laughs> Time to show you. are made to be broken. This ain't a strike! Calculating results. 
insult. Try that again. The machine's threshold. Let's make it quick. Batter up! Push forward. Analysis complete. You can't run! Luck of the draw! Please, 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 please! <laughs> Looks like... Victory! Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move! Better. That's the set. <laughs> Time to show you. What's in your prescription? Much better. If I do like gambling, you have to choose when it's hot. Let's go. <laughs> Rules are made to be broken. <laughs> Look, listen, feel, kick! Better late than never. Time for the payout. You can't run! The machine's threshold. Let's make it quick. <laughs> Looks like somebody needs a duck! <laughs> Gotta get those vitamins! Tasty! Perfectionist! Running into steam right there while I give you a present! Let me tend to your wounds! Say ah! Tasty! Gotta try hard sometimes! Check out this awesome move! Reinforce it! Is complete. High risk individual. Oh. Don't need this, Kyle. Luck of the draw. Please, 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 please. <laughs> Looks like. With me out here, how can we lose? Let's go. Batter up! Execute the violation. You can't run! Execute the operation. <laughs> Time to show you. For the tiles. <laughs> Let's make it quick. Take this. Rules are made to be broken. Calculating the 
result. Time to exceed the threshold. Clara, you, Mr. Sparrow can't fight anymore. Please, please don't hurt him. Clara, Mr. Sparrow, don't push yourself any further. Can you tell them what you know? Mr. Sparrow, you said you were willing to make all my wishes come true, right? My biggest wish right now is for everyone to work together. Like, like family. Recently, I learned something new. Calculation results can't always bring people happiness. Even if the world outside the cage isn't beautiful, people still want to know what it's like. Assessment system reset. Successful. Processing variables. Variable 1. Clara's request. Variable 2. Outsider's intentions. Updated assessment result. Transference of decision-making authority to outsiders. Outsiders are granted access to Stellaron intelligence. So... So we did it? Clara seems like the only one who can break through Svarog's cold logic. It's a good thing she was here. I hope his memory bank really does contain data on the Stellaron. Is this it, Nat? Us? Wildfire? The Underworld? Did... Did we win? No, Zila. Our battle. Their battle. It's just beginning. Finally. We finally made it to this point. Uh, what's up? Nervous? No. But... I do have an aching feeling in my chest. Reveal the truth. I'm listening. I have finished collating the Stellaron data and records. Do you wish to proceed, outsiders? Requesting database materials cache, serial number 13175, encryption level highest. Request approved. Transmission. This is the fruit of many years of research, Madam Guardian. The evidence is irrefutable. This so-called Stellaron is the source all the destruction. The people will struggle to accept this conclusion, Doctor. If we were to tell them that the almighty Elisa Rand activated this thing and triggered the eternal freeze... It's the truth, Madam. The truth won't change with the opinions of the people. The reports before you are the precious result of painstaking effort on the part of Bellabog's greatest scholars. You must trust the weight of its conclusion. I have never doubted you, Doctor. On the contrary, I am resolute in the face of this conclusion. 
From the moment I took up this mantle, that voice, their voice, has made its home in my mind. I cannot shake them. I shouldn't be telling you this. Let's return to your research, Doctor. I'm afraid I cannot make these reports known to the public. Unless... Unless? Unless what? Please, proceed, madam. Unless you have found a way to completely destroy the Stellaron. I understand. In the name of preservation, I will fulfill this mission. Cache number 13175. Transmission complete. Next transmission. Cache number 24830. I don't understand, Doctor. Why do we have to hide such valuable research results away? They're the work of a lifetime. You're, you're still young, child. There will come a day... A day when you do understand. This supreme guardian, she, she sees further than you or I. All the decisions are not for the security of Malabarg. I just think it's a shame. Our research has hit an obstacle. Meanwhile, your results will be buried in the snow. <laughs> don't, don't be upset, child. You, you still have lots of time ahead of you. Uh, when you find a way to... Destroy. <laughs> Destroy the Stellaron. Our efforts will have been worth it. Cash number 24830. Transmission complete. Next transmission. Cash number 57614. This is... Why is there a robot here? During his life, this was Dr. Mearsheimer's personal robot bodyguard. I heard it's a prototype from the Great War. Since the doctor and his assistants passed away, it's remained here. It hasn't moved an inch. Oh, I see. Let's start. We must unearth the doctor's research conclusions. All of them. Madam Guardian, I've found them. All the documents are here. Hmm. Good. That'll do. Madam Guardian, what should we do with the robot? Uh, it would seem a great waste to destroy it. Find someone to reset its system, and then arrange for it to be sent to the Underworld. I hear that the development group is in need of a robot with defense capabilities. Yes, Madam. I'm sorry, Doctor. But these results must be taken care of by the Architects. One day, somebody will be able to carry out your behest. Cache number 57614. Transmission complete. Concluding data transmission. So, the truth is clear now, right? <gasps> and it would appear that they never succeeded. Now only one question remains. Why would Kokolia exhibit such a sudden change in her attitude towards us? Branya, are you okay? I'm, I'm fine. I just I feel a little faint. Why? Why, mother? Maybe, maybe she wasn't aware. Maybe she. I'm sorry. It's no use lying to yourself, Branya. It's time for you to make a decision. Hey, can I have a word with you? I know that we'll need time to process this new information, but we have to decide on our next plan as soon as possible. <sighs> the Furnace Core. The path to the surface is close at hand now. Thank you. 
What you've done has brought new hope to the underworld. Now, we have to wait and see. But maybe this will lead to a new lease on life. Well, you should really be thanking Sampo. If it weren't for his intel, we wouldn't have made it in time. As Wildfire's leader, I couldn't simply look on while you fought on our behalf. We had to come help. Huh? Huh? So you're the real chief? W what about Oleg? Oleg has always acted on my behalf. He helps me deal with all manner of problems in the underworld. Thanks to him, I'm able to make time for the people. I do my best to make sure that they have everything they need. At the same time, I was formulating a plan to deal with Svarog. Your arrival unraveled that carefully crafted yet rudimentary plan. <laughs> and for that, you have my utmost thanks. <laughs> when the underworld recovers its freedom, the people will indeed extol you as heroes. However, even though Svarog is no longer sealing off the Furnace Core, there's no way that we Undergrounders could go pouring onto the surface. That cold-blooded Supreme Guardian has used lies and tricks to keep the surface separated from the Underground. If she detects any change in the Underworld, I don't know what she might resort to. As for Wildfire, we need more time to build up our strength. No, but we need to wait for the opportune moment. In the meantime, I'm sending someone I trust to go with you. Zila. Didn't she tell you? In private, she insisted on accompanying you. Don't let her carefree nature fool you. She's actually very discerning and can read a situation like no one else. Zila is a talented scout and a quick thinker. She takes decisive action. She'll definitely be able to help you. Not to mention, you also have Branya now. It seems like the intel we got from Svarog caused her a significant shock. But with Zila by her side, I know she'll recover. Hey, when's the last time you got some rest? I heard that you've been on your feet looking for Svarog since Rivet Town. Health is everything. You won't be much use if you neglect yours. Let Wildfire take care of the Furnace Core for now. You head back and recuperate. If you're lucky, perhaps tomorrow you can return to the Overworld.
Yeah. <laughs> 